What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Jeremy here back again with another fragrance video. Hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing, man. Hope you guys are in good health. And if you watch this channel, I know you are smelling off the chain. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing, man. Hope you guys are in good health. Hope the family's good. And if you watch this channel here on House of Colossus, man, I know you're smelling off the chain because that's what we do. We get each other right discussing this art of fragrance, man. If that's something that you're interested in, this is your first time here, you like Middle Easterns, Top Tens, New Discoveries, and honestly just having yourself a good time, man, feel free to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so you be notified anytime. Anytime, anytime that I drop new content, man, it's a good place to be. Just ask my Colossus family down in the comment section. So, let's hop right into today's video, y'all, man. Shout out to my boy, Melly Mel Shaves. Melly Mel Shaves, he tagged your boy in five of my top, my top five fragrances for the gym. As you can see, your boy a little, you know, I'm a little, ugh. I got a little something going on. Ugh, a little something. Probably need to work on those. But anyways, you know what I'm saying? You know, I still hoop and stuff like that, man. Get the cardio in. I ain't really much of a lifter. I just, I lift forks and spoons because I like eating. That's my favorite hobby, but don't judge me. But anyways, y'all, we gonna rock out with my top five fragrances for the gym. These are five fragrances I know for sure I have worn to the gym. Typically don't wear fragrances to the gym. However, these are five I know for sure that I have sprayed on before on my way there. You know what I'm saying? So let's hop right into it. The first one, y'all, coming from the house of Rian Tradition. And this is Rian Insurrection 2 Sport. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is their take on Creed Aventus Cologne. So think about Creed Aventus, more aromatic, um, uh, <laughs> more aromatic fresh a little bit of spiciness clean um no birch no smoky effect or anything like that but a four to five hour fragrance smells absolutely amazing love the way it smells again along the lines of that creed events cologne type of dna i love it man i also wear this to sleep too so but yeah i really really dig this this has lemon in it uh some white florals it's pretty dope and it's inoffensive and it smells good. Hey, I wear it to the gym. Honestly, great for spring and summer as well. I will throw that out there. Next one I got for y'all, man. This one has like lemon verbena type of vibe. Very old school, gentlemanly type of fragrance. However, I still enjoy the scent profile, man. This is a very inexpensive fragrance. I think you can get it for as low as like $13, $14 on some of these sites, man. Coming from the house of Machino, y'all. This is Machino Womo. Machino Womo, man. I really, really enjoy this. Again, like a lemon verbena off the coast Italian type of vibe, man. I really enjoy it. Don't last that long. Just another one that I wear to the gym, but I also wear to sleep. Just has a very clean, musky lemon verbena. About a three hour fragrance. It don't last long at all. Great for spring or something. Man, that smells good. After letting it sit for a while, but man. This is some really good stuff, man. Again, if you're more of an older guy, clean, you like clean, fresh, you don't want nothing that lasts a long time, this is a good way to go, man. Again, that is Machino Womo. Next one I got for y'all is a classic in my eyes, man. I've had numerous bottles of this as well as different reiterations of it. I've had Voyage, I had N N83, but this one, y'all, I have told y'all time and time again, being my favorite out of the line, y'all, coming from the house of Nautica, that is Nautica Life. Sea salt, aquatic, fresh, just a really good fragrance. This has the best lasting power out of all of the ones mentioned. This is going to be about seven hours on my skin, but I love it, man. Fresh, again, sea salty, aquatic, marine mass appealing just a very clean fragrance you cannot go wrong with this in my opinion love the way it smells man 
And my opinion, my opinion, it's the best one out of the line, man. Nautica Life for sure. Next one I got for y'all, ain't gonna cost you a lot of money at all. You can get them at the actual store on the website. Sometimes they have it on sale. Um, this one has grapefruit, um, some white florals, woody. Really, really, really love the way this smell. Kinda is like a budget take of Terra de Mez, in my opinion. Coming from the house of Zara, y'all, we have Zara's Vetiver Pulpal Muse. Zara Vetiver Pulpal Muse. So basically, vetiver and grapefruit, y'all. Pulpal Muse is grapefruit and I believe French, I believe. Am I right? Am I wrong? I don't know. I know it means something, but I'm pretty sure it means grapefruit. It, it has to mean grapefruit. Anyways, that's another history lesson. But yeah, man, this is not a long lasting fragrance at all. I will let y'all know that, but it's very, very heavy on that grapefruit. There is a <clears throat> almost like woody, earthy vetiver in the, in the background, but the most prominent thing about this is that grapefruit with heavy, heavy, heavy citrus is sharp, but it does tend to die down. You get some greenness in there, green as well as a woody facet. This, y'all, three, four hours, about, about as much as you're going to get out of it. But at the same time, you're going to be at the gym, so who cares? I really, really enjoy this, though. This is another one I do wear to sleep as well. They say this is an auto parfum concentration. It don't perform like one, but, hey, I bought it. It was only $19. I'm not going to complain. Again, coming from the house of Zara, y'all, that is Zara's Veteran Pulp Amuse, man. Zara Veteran Pulp Amuse. They actually got some really good ones in this line, though. This one is good. Performance just is not bad. I mean, great. Um, we have, also have Ebony Wood. That was my favorite out of the line. I really, really enjoyed that. But, again, we're talking about gem fragrances. We're not talking about what you like, Jeremy. Anyways, down to the final fragrance, y'all. Final fragrance. Honestly, I think this is underrated, man. The Zaro line is very underrated, man. I really, really enjoy this. This one kind of has, like, a tropically type of vibe. I believe there's vanilla in here. I don't know. I kind of get like a coconutty type of feel to it. I really, really enjoy this, man. This is also a fragrance that does pretty well in the winter. One of those fresh fragrances that still kind of cut through the air type of thing. Love the way this smell, y'all. Again, coming from the house of Azaro, that is Azaro's Chrome Pure. Azaro Chrome Pure, man. Again, fruity, coconutty, woody floral type of vibe i really enjoy this man long, <clears throat> long lasting too it's about a seven hour fragrance probably right in the same wheelhouse as nautica nautica life i really really enjoy this man like i think it slept on a lot of people talk about the edp and all that and it's great don't get me wrong extreme edp is really really good but don't sleep on this man this is really really nice man i love the way this smell wrapping out five fragrances that i would Definitely wear it to the gym that I've had wore it to the gym. And they just smell amazing, man. That is Chrome Azaro Pure. One more time. One more time. And that's gonna do it for me, y'all. My name is Jeremy. You are tuned in to the House of Colossus. Don't forget to tell a friend. To tell a friend. To tell one more friend. To have that friend. To tell a friend about my videos, y'all. Until we meet again. Much love for your boy. Definitely down in the comments, y'all. Let me know some fragrances that y'all rock to the gym, man. I definitely would like to know, man. Let's chop it up like we always do in the comment section. Until we meet again, y'all. Much love from your boy. Peace.